If I asked you to come up with a definition of the word courage, what would you say? I've been thinking about this a lot. So, what really is courage? So I looked it up. Pardon my glasses. According to the dictionary, courage is defined as the mental or moral strength to venture, persevere, and withstand danger, fear, or difficulty. And then it had the word venture underlined, like there was a definition elsewhere, kind of like in Wikipedia. So the essential meaning that they gave of venture, and this is according to the Merriam-Webster dictionary, venture, to go somewhere that is unknown, dangerous, or to start to do something new or different that usually involves risk. So I'm going to do a little bit of algebra here since I'm a mathematician and I'm going to do substitution. So courage is the mental or moral strength to go somewhere that is unknown or dangerous or start to do something new or different that usually involves risk and then withstand danger, fear, or difficulty. So when was the last time you did something that you would consider courageous? When was the last time that you had to exhibit courage? Maybe you're having to exhibit it right now. Maybe you're in a situation where you don't know which way to turn, you don't know if you should go forwards or backwards, turn left or turn right. There's a lot of that going on right now with everything that's going on in the world. So courage to me, using those definitions and what I feel in my heart is doing what you know you need to do despite the fear, despite the risk, and doing it anyways because you know it's the right thing to do. I've been posting a lot on my um, public Facebook page some graphic images that have messages on them <coughs> that I have copied from a Christian artist who is known as Toby Mac. Now, I would love to meet the person who is posting on Toby Mac's uh, Facebook page because he is doing an amazing, he or she, they're doing an amazing job of putting together the graphic images and the messages, and it could very well be Toby himself because he's really good with words. I mean, he's a, he writes his own stuff. If you know Toby Mac, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And if you don't, look him up. Um, he might not be your cup of tea musically, but he's a very... Um, talented and gifted artist. I knew him first when he started with DC Talk. Uh, used to be a rapping group and then they split up. But anyways, an image that was posted, I think it was, I'm pretty sure it was this week. And on this image, it has a picture of somebody from the back walking up a staircase. And the caption is, knowing when to walk away is wisdom. Being able to is courage. I would change that to be choosing to is courage. So knowing when to walk away is wisdom. Choosing to takes courage. I hope if you're facing something today, whether it's a decision about your family or your job, that you choose the courageous thing. It's probably not gonna be easy that's what makes it courageous. That's what, that's the definition of courage, right? In closing, I, I wanted to recite something that I'm sure probably everybody has heard. Um, it is dubbed the serenity prayer. And I think people hear it or recite it and maybe don't think that much about it because it is so, so common. But I want to close with this and I hope that you think about it and think about its application to your life, wherever you are right now in whatever's going on in your life. God, grant me the serenity, the peace,
peace. God, grant me the serenity God, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. The courage to change the things that I can. And the wisdom to know the difference. That's my prayer for you tonight as well. Take care and God bless.